a lot of inventions came from California because they were the people um, that had the nerve to come to America on the East Coast. They went even farther. The people that, because they all pretty much came to the East Coast, Ellis Island or wherever. If you just stayed here, you just said, oh, good enough. But those guys went to the edge. It might be a different mindset out there. Yeah, I think they're pretty guarded here, especially in the suburbs. It's like we don't keep the bad guys out. The suburbs keep the suburbans in. It's backwards. Boy, I'm at the curb, you know, picking up some weeds. And I see a woman walking her child to school. I said, good morning. She goes, oh, hello. They're like guarded. Oh, somebody I didn't know that said hello to me. They have to process what to do. But I'm in the... I'm in the hood, so to speak. Uh, hi. They go, hi, what are you doing? Nothing. We're taking a walk. Nice day. It's like it was a million years ago. It's, it's refresh before, like my grandparents in the city, like in the 70s and 60s. It's funny how we've been pitched fear 24 hours a day for about I don't know, since Vietnam. I think it's sank in. And I, I do think America, the parts, are the people as a, as people, individuals, are probably pretty okay. When you put it all together, it falls apart. It's, you know what I mean? The sum of it is worse. There's like negative synergy. I Am I holding it too far away? Oh, sorry. So what brought you to Pakistan? Oh, okay. We have a friend whose husband was a big deal at Coca-Cola in India. And she still has maintained friends that goes back in the winter because it's warm and she has friends there. I'm sure it's not a big gamble, you know. <laughs> it's like her other home. It's probably not a big adventure. It's her, not her other place to go. Yeah, some people go to Florida. She goes to India. Oh, and her dad was the governor of New Jersey, Pat, Pat Driscoll. So they've been around. He was. Yeah, Pat Driscoll. So I guess I have to get my... Okay. I didn't see you. I was in Leonia, but I was about <laughs> one. <laughs> I, we were in Leonia when I was first born. You know, Bergen County. Okay. What did your dad teach? What was his teach? What did he teach? Oh, yeah? What do you think about all that? Yeah, that's a that's a great word for it. I think the part of helping people that don't have wells and doing something mission style is probably great, but I think I have a friend that's a priest, I have several. And we I said, What's with this tradition? Somebody says traditionally we do whatever. 
He said, I said, I find traditions to be holding you back. And he said, oh, yeah, it's called the shackles of tradition. And I'm, I see a preacher at the corner, like in a parking lot, a Baptist guy preaching hellfire and brimstone. And he goes, God fearing, uh, uh, uh. I said, sir, I don't fear God or anybody or anything. I appreciate God's our ally. He probably is why he's why we're here. And why would you fear him? Well, okay. And then he said, who's Jesus? I said, he's a role model. Okay, that's a good answer. I said, by the way, who made the list of sins? Some guys? Said, well, kind of. There's a lot of venturism in, I said that to him. Or he, I said some men did. I think we're born with conscience and people maybe impose on it and goof you up. I do think that because I watched a little boy in church. He's looking like he's watching a movie. He's just all eyes. And I couldn't, I was trying to close this door and it kept not staying closed. He darts away. He can't talk yet. And he takes his little finger that happened to fit in and he closed the door. He processed it. He knew what he could do and he did it. And nobody told him to do it, not to do it, or to be scared of running or anything. And I see that he was born fully blown smart. And I just hope nobody scares him into su submission, American way. Oh, and I, I'm friends with Michael Doyle. He's kind of famous. You could see him on YouTube and things. The Camden 28 in the 60s. And they go, God, we are not worthy to receive you. Bup, 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 bup. I, but the black churches, they don't say that. And of course we're worthy. He's our ally, I would say. It's a funny, it's a funny spin. It's a terrible spin we've been hearing for a hundred years here. And I don't, I have a problem that my great, my uncle or whatever he is, my great uncle came from Italy with his Bugatti in the hold of the ship. And my friends came chained in holds of ships here. The disparity is a pisses me off in a sense. Yeah, the manifest destiny that founded this country is awful. Let's break bread on Thanksgiving, but we're going to shoot you later because we want more of it. So the country's kind of based on... Hmm? Ha <laughs> ha.